Good day, and welcome to the jungle. Or, if you were to use its proper name, Tropical Rainforest. In Minecraft, jungles are these vibrant, dense tangles of trees and bushes, with giant trees stretching into the skies. But how do they compare to their real-life counterpart? Well, tropical rainforests in the real world are lush, hot forests found around the equator that, that need to receive at least 254 centimetres of rainfall per year. That's 100 inches if you're American. Minecraft doesn't do too bad. It's a warm biome with a lush forest, and the trees aren't too terrible either. They fit into the layers of shrubs, the under canopy, and the canopy pretty well. And they even include these huge emergent trees that stick out from everything else. However, the trees are a little bit too sparse. There are too many openings and not enough tree cover. Not too terrible, but it definitely needs a bit of work. When it comes to rainfall, I'll forgive the jungle because it's not its fault that Minecraft's weather system is bad and needs a total rework. But that's a topic for a different video. My real issue with Minecraft jungles though, is their lack of biodiversity. IRL tropical rainforests are renowned for one thing. Well, aside from being wet, they're incredibly high levels of biodiversity. Biodiversity is the variety of plants and animals in an area. Places with high biodiversity have lots of plants and animals, and places with low biodiversity have few. Jungles are one of the most biodiverse ecosystems on the planet, and Minecraft is terrible at representing this. Yeah, we have the warm animals and ocelots and pandas and parrots, but that's barely a scratch of the real world rainforest animals, of which there are millions, especially arthropods like beetles, ants and other insects which just aren't represented at all. It's not just a lack of variety though, there also just aren't many of these mobs. I've been in this jungle biome for around an hour now, and I haven't even run into a single parrot. It just makes jungles feel empty, which is the complete opposite of how they should feel. It's not just animals though. What do you see in this image? Well, in this image, you can find every single plant in jungles in game but you probably only notice the cow. Our brains just don't usually notice plants much. There are many reasons why, but I won't go into it. It's a very interesting phenomenon though, and I brought it up to point out the fact that jungles just don't have many different plants. There's grass, ferns, melons, bamboo, cocoa beans, oak and jungle trees, but that's it. IRL, there are way more plants than animals in jungles. I really wish jungles in game had more to offer, like large bushes, flowers, fruits, and way more trees. I'd love to have a more varied wood set. Speaking of which though, how realistic are jungle trees specifically? This may be obvious, but jungle isn't a real type of tree. Although that didn't quite stop me. This is the yellow Maranti, and I'd say it's probably the closest IRL counterpart. They both look similar with tall straight trunks, and they're also one of the most common jungle trees. But they aren't an exact match. IRL, jungle trees are adapted to their environment in many different ways. Waxy leaves, tall trunks, and my favorite, buttress roots. Buttress roots are large wide root structures that provide structure to the tree, especially with their shallow root systems in jungles. This is how I would recreate jungle trees to make them a little bit more realistic. I'd say they're already quite good, but I'd, all I'd like to see added is buttress roots on the tall trees especially. Overall, are jungles realistic? Uh, sorta. In an old Minecrafty sort of way. While they don't do a terrible job, there is a lot of room for improvement. I'd love to see an update focused around adding more plants and animals to jungles, especially stuff like sloths, ants, harpy eagles, beetles, and especially more trees. There's a really cool mod called Jay's Mod, which adds stuff like butterflies, mahogany trees, and fruit bats to jungles, as well as a bunch of other stuff that I wanted to shout out. But that's all for today, folks. 
I really hope you enjoyed the video. It was a quick one to make, but I thought it'd be fun. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Au revoir.